Ah, bleep. Here we go again. That's right. The second He-Man television show of 2020 has been released and it is getting absolutely eviscerated in the YouTube comments section. And YouTube are, and t Netflix is being questioned as to why a second He-Man show is being released before they've even finished the first one. Now look, the target for this new He-Man show is not nostalgic original He-Man fans. So you have to actually give it a little bit of a break. This isn't for us. Whereas He-Man Revelations was clearly to, uh, to made to appeal to that nostalgic audience, the original OG fans, you know, the 80s and 90s kids who grew up watching He-Man. So to be fair, uh, you have to kind of grade on a scale, but it is bringing some interesting questions up, like what's going on with Kevin Smith's, Kevin Smith's uh, Masters of the Universe Revelation Part 2 of Season 1. Why is Netflix acting like it doesn't exist? Netflix is disabling comments on the video. Uh, it is getting absolutely ratioed, and it looks, well, like Fortnite He-Man. But I suppose, again, it's not targeted towards me. What I'm interested in is the conversation around it. He-Man and the Master of the Universe Netflix trailer, as bad as Kevin Smith's series. This is from Cosmic Book News. Netflix has released... The trailer for the CGI He-Man and Master of the Universe series, which doesn't look much better than the recent Kevin Smith disaster of a show. I actually disagree. I think the Kevin Smith show looked pretty good. Uh, the story, pretty bad. Um, but the, the, the look of He-Man wasn't too bad. Similar to Kevin Smith's Revelation series, this series seems to focus more on a female character than He-Man. Shocking. And instead of, I have the power, it's, we have the power. Cringe indeed. It blows my mind that Mattel greenlit this stuff while trying to sell more toys, and I feel bad for today's youth that their cartoons are utter garbage. We also see the CGI is produced by Rob David, who is behind the Smith series, and DC Comics that are a joke. Makes sense. Uh, now, if we look at the actual show, you know, the animation is clearly aimed at at you know a young audience and if we look at it what is that 1.2 uh it's not uh oh it is now at 1.7 thousand upvotes to 1.4 thousand downvotes and comments are turned off now it is uh comments are generally turned off when you have a video that's on youtube kids or that you that you delineate or denote as for kids. So that's probably why this is, but it's also convenient. Now, if we look through it, just checking out a little bit of it, I mean, I can't speak to much. Uh, well, so Netflix claimed my review of this trailer. Shocking, shocking development that Netflix needs to make literally every possible penny that they could. Um, and so now I have to kind of give you an idea of what's happening. It's currently sitting at 1.9 thousand upvotes, 1.6 thousand downvotes. The show looks bad uh, to my eye, but I'm 38 years old. The show's not for me. Again, to be clear, it wasn't marketed to me like Kevin Smith went out of his way to do and the marketing team behind Masters of the Universe went out of their way to do. So, you know, I'm coming into it basically saying, hey, here's a show called He-Man. It's clearly not the He-Man I remember. You've got what is what looks like an Overwatch character. Um, I mean, you know it's, it's going to be Netflix. It's going to be formulaically diverse. Um, they have these weird big eyes. Okay, fine. Um, here's the, you know, what I'll say is it looks bad to me. It looks like um, like a in-game cutscene for Overwatch or Fortnite or something like that. But, the you know, being the second time I've gone through this, 
it the dialogue is very clearly uh, aimed at a new audience that doesn't really know He Man or have any you know affinity to He Man. Um, so it's just it's not offensive to me, other than you know it's just yet another property from my youth that is you know applied to um, you know today's kids. So parents will say, "I remember He Man," and then put it on for their kids. One of the more cringe lines in this. Um, is instead of saying by the power of Grayskull, I have the power, they literally change it to by the power of Grayskull, we have the power. Um, yeah, we have the power. And then you have like your uh, you know checkbox inducing cast here. Tire looks kind of cool. Um, but again, not for me. So I'm not like as emotionally attached to it. it just looks like a modern trash cartoon. Um, but hey, if it's entertaining, I guess. I, to me, it's obviously nothing like He-Man. But. Oh, now it's we have the power. Oh. By the power Here we of go. Grayskull. Oh. Cringe. Uh, how very diverse, of course. That's just modern entertainment. There's not anything inherently wrong with that. We've got a nice blue-haired female. We've got what I assume is a female here in the middle. I don't know. And here's the only outwardly male-looking character there. And the line does look pretty sweet. Um, so now, yes, it's we have the power. Um... And it's just not good looking. Skeletor actually looks okay. To know oneself. Eh. To truly I mean, maybe. A master of the universe. A master of the what now? It's obviously not He-Man, but it's got a He-Man veneer. If you look at the replies here. It's pretty interesting, okay? More She-Ra. And what's up with the other He-Man and Masters of the Universe? You know the one that already in Netflix? Where are the rest of the episodes? Uh, time to pass the sword. So this Masters of the Universe, of course, just willing to do whatever it takes to sell more toys. Similar success. That's rich. At least this one looks more fun. Yeah, I mean, I would argue that this does look more fun. Um, and then, you know, again... Here's here's your, here's an adult with a mask in the profile photo as usual. Pronouns also there. Super excited for adults to have thoughts about a kids show. Looks like something my kid might watch, but she wants she wants more How to Train Your Dragon. Honestly, you're an adult commenting on a kids show. How very unself aware. Um, the awkward moment when two He Man shows released the same year. He Man Fortnite Edition. Yeah, I mean. It's not He-Man. It's not as He-Man as I remember it, but it's not for me. You know, it's not for adults. But the media is already, you know, p portraying people as as losing their mind over it. I don't know if people are losing their mind on, on it. Um, it at least is different. At least it's like, you know, it's pretty general Netflix woke garbage, but... The kids will probably like it, and maybe that'll open them up to actual He-Man. Literally, why? Not a fan, but it wasn't made for me. Um, they liked Revelations. Nah, this will be better than Revelations. That show, Kevin, that show was trash, and Kevin Smith should be ashamed. I mean, not bad. Um, I like to see that people are still sticking to Netflix. It's the series for all the haters of Master of the Universe have been waiting for. Heh. <laughs> no, it isn't. Didn't this show used to look a lot better? <laughs> I mean, is this Fortnite? I don't know. It doesn't look right. He-Man, He-Man's in it? LOL. At least He-Man does apparently look like he's in it. But of course, that's the trailer. We saw that with Masters of the Universe. 
You can see here the trailer for Netflix's other new He-Man series looks very different from Masters of the Universe Revelation. Around the time that Netflix announced that Kevin Smith was developing a He-Man series that would complete the story from the classic 80s cartoon, the streaming giant also teased the new He-Man series was in the works. Well, apparently Netflix was messing around Sorry, wasn't messing around because their trailer's already here. While well, He-Man has always been a mishmash of medieval and sci-fi weaponry, the new series has a much more futuristic slant to it and also seems aimed at a younger audience than Revelation. So it'll be interesting to see how the angry nerds will react to this latest take on He-Man. Spoiler alert, they will probably still be angry. I've, I've got to admit, I, I really am not angry. Um, it's a show that isn't for me. And what's most important here is that the creator of this show didn't pretend they were a fan of Masters of the Universe, didn't pretend that He-Man was going to be a hero in his own show, didn't go out of their way to disparage other YouTubers and say that they were crazy forever uh, asserting that He-Man wouldn't be in his own new show and then be found out to be a fraud and a liar and go on to abandon the show immediately after the fandom hated it so that they could work on Clerks 3. The difference is this is just another soulless incarnation regurgitation of a classic television show or license that is nothing like the original and won't capture the soul or magic of it in any possible way. It's another Teen Titans. It's another... Um, you know, garbage factory driven cartoon that kids will watch because there's nothing else on. I don't think that it's fair to go after, uh, you know, the same group of people that didn't like Revelation because, as always, people weren't pissed that he meant that Masters of the Universe Revelation sucked, which it did. They were mad that. Well, I'm sure people were mad about that, but they were more mad that, again, Kevin Smith went out of his way to lie. We haven't seen anybody coming out on this show, the showrunner of this show, pretending to be a huge fan, a lifelong fan of He-Man and calling people, um, telling people to sit the F down and arguing with the fans. They just quietly went to work and put out what looks like um, a forgettable, generic television show made for kids. You, know, you see... Netflix's other He-Man trailer a series has a trailer, and oh boy. I mean, it's nothing like He-Man, but at least it's an original take on it. I'll actually give it credit for that. It's not for me, um, like Revelation was, but I'm happy to ignore this as yet another just soulless reincarnation of a beloved franchise like She-Ra and all sorts of other stuff like that. Hope you enjoyed this video. Kevin Smith still sucks, and we'll talk to you again real soon.